Hey guys, so this showed up at my house. Well, not really my house because mail doesn't come to our house. So this showed up at my post office box. And uh, yeah, super excited about it. This one is Minnie Mouse at like a little craft area. And I saw this on Amazon so many times. Like, it was ridiculous. I saw it like four or five times. And then the last time I was like, you know what, I'm buying this because I really want it to put up in my room with all my craft stuff. <laughs> so I got it. And did I need another diamond painting? No. No, I didn't. But I got it anyways. And Scott, he told me that I did need another diamond painting so that I could do another diamond painting. So yeah, four-year-old logic. Gotta love them. Let's get this open. This is a 30 by 40, which is like my favorite size because it's not too big, but it's not too small. It's big enough for the picture to show. Hopefully this one is, this one didn't have other sizes. It was just the 30 by 40, which I would have liked to have a bigger one of this because there's a lot of detail in here. So hopefully it comes across pretty well. Let's see if I can get you a better picture of that. that showing up looks really cute there's 20 colors it's printed really nice and they did their it's one through nine is the number and then 10 through 20 are letters alphabetically so that's a great key I really like that I like that it's in order here's the drill field it's really clear looking I'm excited to do this this is a full round. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> the uh, gel was evidently wrapped around the tray and shipping or something, because now it's like a, well, this way it's an N, but it's like a U shape or something. But this one came with a little grippy, a pen, a tray, and a little thing of wax. Not a lot of them from Amazon come with a little grippy, so that's cool. And our drills are in here. It doesn't look like they have drill numbers. Yeah, they just have the diamond, like the painting number. And then they have the number for the color. But look at those, those are really pretty. See a bright yellow, a bright pink, bright purple. Here's a bright blue, so cute. Let's get them out real quick. Alright, so I guess we're going to go backwards. Wait, what if I show you this side that doesn't have that across it? This is cute. It's like a corally color. Is this the same? Oh, these must be like one number off because they look exactly the same. Like this one, maybe a little bit purpler or something. That one's really pretty. Lots of pink. Some dark blue, some dark purple. Brown. A peach. A nice yellow. Orange. More red, more pink, R310, another pink, and is this like a, it's like an aqua type color, it's like a greeny blue, I don't really, I guess that's, is that aqua or is that teal? I don't know, it's pretty though, I like it. I'm really excited about this one, um, yeah, so right now I have one corner of my stitch left to do. It's actually over here, but it's under a bunch of stuff. I guess I could pull it out. I'll pull it out. That wasn't hard. So for stitch, I just have this little section right here left and I've just been slacking. Like I could just knock that out, but hopefully this will be done this week. It was supposed to be done last weekend. That was my goal, but didn't need that. 
And then this is my next one. It's kitted up already. It's like the sun, or not sunset, it's like the sky with the beach and the couple that a lot of people do. Here's the, maybe that'll come up better. Yeah, so there's the little image. I know it's still kind of blurry, but this one looks really good. I'm excited for this one, and it is a 40 by 50. So that's the next one I'm gonna work on. I have it kitted up, I just haven't worked on diamond, diamond paintings after I kitted that one up. So I'll be working on that one and this one this week. And if I finish my stitch in the next couple days, I'll probably kit up this one. And the same, like I'll get my gems for the stitch when I get put away and then I'll kit this one up just so I can work on this one because it's really cute and I want it up on the wall. But yeah, I did finish my Paris one, but uh, I don't know where it is. I didn't even frame it yet and it's somewhere. I have like six crafts going on right now, so it's kind of a mess, but I will find it eventually, hopefully. Yeah, so um, yeah. This was the Minnie Mouse Craft Room Diamond Painting Unboxing. It's from Amazon. I did buy this myself. It was, I think, like $10, so not really bad. Especially with, like, 20 colors and the drill field is really clear. Let's check the glue real Yeah, the glue is really good. Oh, you couldn't even see that. Sorry. really sticky I like it a lot and it doesn't go past the um, drill area very much it's about like I don't know a fourth of an inch maybe not bad at all because like when it comes past the drill field a lot I always get stuck to it and it just makes me mad I know you can put washi on it but a couple times I tried to use washi, it didn't stick right and it just made me mad because it would come up. So anyways, that's my latest diamond painting. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye!